Millions of security systems, smartphones and tablets use a fingerprint instead of a password for security. It's supposed to be uncrackable, but it now appears fingerprint technology is easily hackable. Elsa Ramon joins us with more and Elsa, we thought this was supposed to be completely secure. You're definitely not alone in that. Most of us did, but a hacker is showing just how easy it really is to steal someone's fingerprint without stealing anything they've touched. Photos with clear views of hands and fingers can now be used to recreate a fingerprint. Jan Chrysler, known to hackers as Starbug, did just that. He says these pictures of the German defense minister were taken with a standard camera from about 10 feet away. Starbuck says he was then able to zero in on her fingerprints and reproduce them using readily available software. The whole security of the system relies on keeping something secret that isn't secret. Starbug has been exposing what he calls flaws in biometric security for years. Days after the finger scanning iPhone 5S was released, he successfully unlocked a phone by recreating a dummy finger. He did it by using glue to make a mold from a photocopied fingerprint. And Starbucks says fingerprints are even less secure than standard passwords because once they're stolen, they can't be changed. This would be a very targeted thing. You have somebody, their photos are publicly available, they're an important person, and the rewards outweigh the risks. There are other options. A company called ViewSonic is reportedly working on a new smartphone, which scans users' eyes to gain access. Well, until then, the experts say stick with the old-fashioned password or use it in addition to the fingerprint one. I'm Elsa Ramon. Lena and Sylvia, back to you.